It's a work by Van Duisburg from 1926 that we're looking at. It's a maquette and a drawing and a design all in one. This was a work that he did for a famous project called the Café Obet in Strasbourg. It was the collaboration between Van Duisburg with two other artists, Sophie Teuber and Jean Arp. And it was the first time that architecture and abstract art were combined. Why is that important? Well, when you look at art history, the um, collaboration between architects and artists are very rare. You can go back to the Sistine Chapel, and that's why sometimes this particular work and the execution of it was referred to as the Sistine Chapel of Abstract Art. Because you have a very complex system of colors, which we were told by experts are based actually on Goethe's color theory, which is rather interesting when you think about a contemporary artist going back that far. And that particular maquette shows this wonderful ceiling with all these color charts. And next to it in the sphere, here on the left, you will see the space how it was implemented in 1928, which was unfortunately later on destroyed. Obviously today we have things much better protected, but at that time it wasn't. However, the reconstruction that was done is pretty good and you can visit it today and you'll see the impact that this kind of work has still today. Why is that important? Why is that work still speaking to us today? And what are you looking for when you look at a work of art? In my opinion, what's an important work of art is something that has a long-lasting value, something that was revolutionary at the time, and something that still gets you today interested and where you still have an emotional reaction to it.